my little last minute addition to our meal and madness lockdown marathon is done. It's very yellow, very shiny, very basic and very plain. Let me tell you what happened and show you how it's come out. Yes, hello, my vacuum cleaner chums. How are you today? Are we enjoying me in a fortnight? It's nearly at an end, if you can tell dates and times and know how long a fortnight is. But this late edition is done. This is the hose. It's cleaned up fairly well. It's got a different end on it. That's why it looks slightly better, because this end that I had is just a little bit less warm. But this is the original machine end. And it's perfectly fine. Indeed, our little S300i, sadly, the writing on the back door, you can just about see the fettered remains of it washed straight off. It was a right pain. I've not even polished it, just washing it got rid of that. And then somebody said to me on Facebook that he now looks, especially from that angle, like the pictures you see on, you know, fake not fake, cheap packets of bags and they can't use a brand name on the packaging. So the silhouette, it does, it does look like a silhouette vacuum. It's very shiny now, very clean, there's just a little bit of scratching. It doesn't really reflect the light, it just absorbs it and looks very yellow. Under here, well, I found an upholstery tool, we had that in the tool collection and then just the original dusting brush again very worn and loose but the bristles are beautiful so that's worth keeping and the crevice tool which just does crevice tooly things really i think there we go inside here it's a bit squeaky but we have a genuine bag genuine filter with the filter holder here holding it nicely into place and of course eh, our post motor filter in there all cleaned up very nicely indeed and for a fiver i'm very happy with how it came out and of course back here well we just have on off and cord rewind and it works very well I just find some power, plug it in, well, that's all we can do folks, that's, this is it, this is just on and off, of course didn't have any tools so I borrowed the S255i's and we'll see if it can clean any of this mess up. S255i parking slot fits the parking slot on the machine perfectly. So all in all, bar being very basic, I mean, I have the bleed valve open on the hose end for that video clip because it, it just skips around this. Cord rewind works ferociously well. Couple of little points, well, one big point of admin is that it hasn't got its original motive in it anymore. That 
is here. Yes, very sadly. Where is it? There it is. Look, it cracked. It cracked there. There, no, like there first, but held, and it's actually got brand new bearings in it. It was when I was trying to fit it back together that it snapped actually underneath where the carbon brush goes and when that went that was it it was game over so i had a bit of a moan i put the spare motor that we got out of a meter cough last week whatever it was and this has been made to be honest the armature and the coil are really good in this and that's all i'm really going to need i've got a set of good bearings two brand new 608 zeds should i have the need to take them out and yeah i think all in all look we have side parking action as well just like the s311i this s300i is done and we can tick another one off the list although obviously this one was a bit of a naughty purchase because it came from ebay and not from the job lot whoops e daisy so thank you very much for watching i hope you're enjoying me the week so far at the time of filming this i've got two more videos left to film their plans something exciting came to well, something not exciting something broken came today which we can probably resurrect so i think tomorrow's video is going to be some more administration with the machines that we haven't yet seen since we saw the befores so stay tuned for that comment below have you ever had such a basic meal have you ever seen one for sale because i've often thought that this machine is probably the one that was you know 99.99 under a hundred pounds and then you paid like 130 quid for one with the dial to change the power so yeah comment with any memories of basic mealers below oh that doesn't like doing that and i will see you tomorrow bye bye